This is Jimmy D from Scrutinizer. I had a customer ask me, why am I seeing a difference between my MRTG traffic and my NetFlow traffic? Remember, with NetFlow traffic, you're getting all the Layer 3 conversations that have happened on that router. You're basically seeing exactly what they're saying and what's going on at any given time. With MRTG, you're seeing Layer 2 and Layer 3 traffic, but you're only seeing the total traffic. So you're not able to get deep into that traffic and see what's going on and why it's happening. Um, you're going to see a small uh, difference between the two, maybe 3 to 5%. Um, and at that point, uh, you're going to be able to get more information with NetFlow. Remember, here in Scrutinizer, this is a data set. So I'm seeing a specific uh, interface um, on a router. And I'm saying, OK, I want to start. Uh, I really want to get a report that shows me all the traffic. Well, you can do that by going up here change the view and you're going to see traffic volume and this is again only with scrutinizer 7.0 you're going to be able to see the traffic volume for that interface you're also going to be able to um, add filters to it to see um, you know specifically what else is going on in your uh, information so why am I seeing the difference well because there is a uh, layer 2 and layer 3 traffic on the MRTG graph uh, but remember it's only showing you the total traffic. It's not telling you what it is and uh, giving you more information about it. With Scrutinizer, you're able to see that. And with the traffic volume report, you can still get that traffic volume information. This is Jimmy D from Scrutinizer. If you have any questions, you can email me, jimmyd at plixer.com. Thanks.